Hello and welcome back everybody to another video of Trails of Cold Steel 2. Lyot of Hyrule speaking. Um, last time we got all of class 7 together when found the final member of our team, Yusis Alborea. And now we are having a rest, a rest day. Um, as you can see, um, we are back in Ymir. Uh, Valimar brought us back here. This is going to be our final rest day, and this is going to be the only day in which we will have, um, seven points. Uh, seven bonding points to use. Um, so we're gonna use these bonding points and... Grow our bond with our friends and keep going and see what the uh, rest of the story holds. So let's go. So I'm going to go talk to Elliot's dad here pretty soon after we're done using these bonding points and tell him what we've decided to be able to do to help out with this civil war that's going on in Arabonia right now. stuff. Porsche. It's good stuff. awkward <laughs> So sad. Of course they did.
Oh, that's exciting. All right, one point used. Let's go see if I can find my buddies and see if I can use the rest of them. Hi, Celine. Hi, Emma. She's paying a scarf. A wool. Not a scarf. She's buying some wool. I wonder if Selene is like an Annie Marges, like, can transform into a human or whatever, or she's just a cat. was my thought about her being a human. She's full of cat. Be 
bathe your feet. Very good. Heat rust. One winding time with Emma. We're gonna see what she's saying. sense. Our brain doesn't matter. All right. Now that I'm done with bonding with Emma, I'm not done with Emma. That sounds mean. Done bonding with Emma. I'm gonna go see. If I can find. Um, Gaius. Dang it. Nope. Oh, there he is. Hey, guys. We're 
going to brainstorm with Gaius. Let's go. It's our hawk buddy. Oh, Zio, that's his name. a bloodhound. Hi, Zio. my dad. There's Sarah.
Ah, uh, the good stuff. Don't mind me, ginger ale too. So we are going to be training, looks like. Yarg! What's up, Sarah? Everybody 
So everybody has their own things that they want to be able to, to do. Reen has decided that they're going to go in as a third party. Reen also said that everybody has their own things that they want to do. Elisa's worried about Ruer. Lee, or, um, Elliot can't get in contact with Fiona. Machias' dad is under arrest. And now we're going to see what goes on next. It's a huge relief to see you're alright, Sharon, but Mother's still unaccounted for. I'm sorry I can't do more to comfort you, my lady. And I have no idea where Father's been for the past month. I'm certain he must be well, but all the same. We're all worried about our families, I see. Family's most important. We do have a, granted, we do have a divine knight so we can uh, use as little or so that's all the more reason why um, these why Thor's military academy students have to be extremely careful because they can influence the war one way or the other they got to be careful with that too because that could lead to, lead to some disastrous um, unforeseen things hopefully we can find some information on all of them before the fighting gets any more fierce <laughs> I'm certainly not worried about the safety of mine Although, suffice it to say, if we choose to intervene in the war, conflict with them is all but inevitable. That goes for Zeno and Leo, too. Yep. They've been hired by the Noble Alliance, so I'd say it's likely we'll run into them in the future. Oh boy. Plus, Emma and I still need to talk to Vita to see what exactly she's trying to do. To figure out what's so important to her that she was willing to break a taboo to do it. That's true. Whatever you decide to do, you'll have my full support. Good, thanks, Gaius. Just as the warriors of Nord did 250 years ago, I'm determined to fight to protect my second homeland and those who live within it. Oh, same! We can do this! I can back them up, right, Claire? How could I say no? Easily, no. I have my own duties to take care of as part of the Railway Military Police, but I fully intend to support all of you with everything I have. I'm thinking it's about time I return to helping the Guild, actually. But I'll still be in touch with Sarah, so I'm sure I can lend a hand or two anytime you need it. Darn it, it means we lose to a vault. <laughs> Naturally, I'd be overjoyed to continue serving as your dormitory's caretaker. Yay! I'm your instructor, so you're stuck with me to the very end. Whatever you choose to do, you'll have my support. Just as long as you don't nag us, Sarah. You're going to need to decide on a more specific course of action, though. Resolving to find a third way is a start, but only a start. It also leaves plenty of questions that need to be answered on top of it all. Well, then how about this? Let's figure out right now whether or not we want to keep using Ymir as our base of operations. That is a good question. Just so we're clear on this, there's a limit to how many people can use the spirit path at any one time. And with as many people as we have now, I'm not sure how useful it's going to be at this point. And we're limited on how frequently we can use it. Oh, right. But we're also just as limited on where we can go otherwise. We haven't exactly been the most subtle group around. Who's mm -hmm. to say we could even operate elsewhere? Point taken, Machias. An astute point. The Noble Alliance will no doubt be even more wary of us than before. Joy. In the end, no matter what we decide, we lose. Indeed. Yet we're short on time, so a decision must be made now. There's gotta be something that only we can do. Yeah. I don't know what it is, but I know it exists. And I'm sure that we'll find it. The best thing we can do now is keep talking things out until we find a way. There's no point in rushing into a decision. Well, doesn't this look fun? Who the Mind if I flip join is in? this? What in the world? Yes, I very much mind. It couldn't be. This would be. Vita. Of course. How did you find us? <laughs> it's lovely to see you again, Emma. You were finally able to reunite with all of your classmates. 
I'm happy for you. Really, I am. The goddess was on your side after all, hmm? Speaking of Emma and Vita... <sighs> Cut the crap, Vita. Have you been listening in all this time? Where are you? <laughs> I'm not far at all. Listen closely now. Uh, she's really starting to become a thorn in my side. Th that sounds just like... Is that... It's coming from above us! They're gonna drop something on us? Forces flagship? Yikes. What's the Pantagruel doing here? Damn it! I didn't think she'd tell the rest of their army where we were. Um, well, there goes Jimir the for our base of operations. But why now? <laughs> why? Because our preparations are finally complete. In the witch flesh. Vita, you're here. Or flesh flesh. Yes, I am here, in the flesh. Good day to you all, Class 7. Um, hi. Hmm. As nice as it would be to finally give you a hug, Emma. I wouldn't want to keep our guest of honor waiting any longer. So, without further ado... Guess the butter. Oh, what the? It can't be. Isn't that the Azure Knight? Crow? Crow? Are you kidding? <sighs> oh boy. <laughs> Long time no see, guys. Hey, Sorry for dropping in on you like this, but I'm sure you know the drill by now. You ready to have some fun? Uh, no. Is that really you, Crow? There's no doubt about it. See, you damn terrorist. Come on! Right! Heed my call! Valimar! I know it. Again. I'm not gonna lose this time because at the end of the day he's just an obstacle that needs to be overcome so lend me your power Valimar very well use my power as you see it You've really taken to piloting since your last encounter, haven't you? I was hoping you would, and you didn't let me down. You- But potential is only that. Potential. And you, Reen, might want to reevaluate just how many obstacles need overcoming. What's that supposed to mean? Uh, 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 this is bad. Yeah, this is really bad. Aren't those the Alliance's allies? Long time no see, kiddos. You doing all right, Fee? I see the purple lightning has joined your ranks. Zeno. Leo. Zephyr. And a few members of Ouroboros, too. Guess all the big guys wanted a piece of us today. Guess so. And look, Sammy's here, too. Kindly stop referring to Clown Soleus with that bizarre nickname. Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> oh, it's such a pleasure to visit this wintry wonderland once again. Oh, it's a pleasure, all right. The time for my long-awaited revenge has finally come. Now you shall pay! 
It's only been two days since you first fought them, you know. This could pose a problem. Why send so many powerful allies here? And all at once? <laughs> You've proven to be rather formidable adversaries, after all. It wouldn't do to underestimate you. Rufus! Looks like, we're, <clears throat> looks like we're bringing everybody to the party. I'm pleased to see you all again, ladies and gentlemen of Class 7. Hello, Rufus Alborea. As for you, dear brother, I was told that you'd run away from home. Does my heart good to see you safe and sound? Oh, stop lying. So, you finally gathered up the will to make the difficult choices life set at your feet, I presume. Sure. Even if those choices place you in my line of fire? Yep. Yes, I have. People in he's shown up too. The Noble Alliance is pulling out all the stops to finally get rid of us, aren't they? It's just one big happy party. Reen, we'll take care of everything here. You and Valimar have your own battle to fight. Are you right. sure? <laughs> We're in for a real brawl out here, but a guy couldn't ask for better opponents. Leave the battle on the ground to us. <laughs> We've no intention of backing down without a fight. Oh, wait, Sharon! I know they're all strong, but still. Well, what do you say we get started? All right, Chloe. Here he comes! <laughs> I'm impressed. You managed to hold your own better than I expected you to. It's only been a month or so, but you've really grown as an awakening, Reen. Well, it's hard to go through the kinds of things I have without growing from the experience. True that. And now that I've done all that, I'm going to be the one who takes you down! We said going brawl. <laughs> no, you're not. I said you could hold your own, not that you could win. Remember, there's still a three-year gap's worth of experience between us. Oh, shit. And it's time you realize just how much of an impact that gap has. That's enough, Crow! Do they really stand a chance? Well, they're putting up a good fight so far, but... Yeah, it's not looking good. They're outnumbered, for one thing. Then it's time we lent them our aid. Agreed. Weapons at the ready, guys. Always in a rush, aren't you? Stay right where you are. I'll serve as your opponent today. Y you will? Trying to stop us from joining in? <laughs> I'd rather our intrusion cause as little inconvenience as possible for the people of this village. I'll let you make the first move. It's been quite some time since I last instructed you in fencing uses. I look forward to seeing how you've improved. Wow. I'm concerned the fact you kicked the crap out of Wayne. His guard's perfect. Stay alert. Rufus is a master of court fencing. We'll need to put all we have into this battle to even stand a chance against him. I would have it no other way. Show me what you're... Shut up. Very, very well. First. Marcus, active! 
of it. Leave it to me. My boy! <clears throat> right. Keep it up, everyone! My turn. Good. Listen to my song of healing! I suppose I should thank you. I won't deny that was an entertaining diversion. But you'd do well to intensify your training regimen if you hope to best me. <sighs> well, how is he so strong? He didn't stand a chance. He might even be stronger than Sarah. Are you guys okay? Oh, you know, I just got my butt kicked. Hey, you really think you've got time to be worrying about them? You ain't getting out of this one, Green. All right, bring it on! It's time to settle this, Crow! Bring it on! This will be a tough one. Be careful! Settled enough for you? 
<clears throat> you didn't even bother to use that trump card of yours. Uh, he wasn't even trying last time, then, was he? <laughs> Come on. With the way you are now, I don't even need to try. I'll always win. And that, Reen, perfectly illustrates just how massive the gulf between us is. Maybe you think you've had it tough up till now, but you're gonna need to go through a hell of a lot more if you want to even the odds. Hey. <laughs> See, the battle here has come to an end. Ah, oh, hey, Via. Hmm. I can't help but feel a little bummed that everything went exactly as I thought it would. Still, it just goes to show how much faith I have in your skills, my sweet Azure Chevalier. Funny, I don't recall ever becoming yours. How's everything up top? I think it's only a matter of time before the battle is decided. But... We've caused enough trouble for the people of Ymir already. It's about time we brought this to a close. That is just Fenestra oh, Fantastic Window. My apologies for not coming down to speak with you in person, ladies and gentlemen of Thor's Military Academy. You know who I am, of course, but I am Duke Kayen, ruler of the Lemaire province and supreme leader of the Noble Alliance. Duke Kayen? So even the big guy himself is here. <laughs> <sighs> Looks like we found Duke. Duke Kayen. I must say, what a curious group we have here. I heard as much, but allow me to extend my most heartfelt congratulations. My expectations have thoroughly been exceeded. When I saw young Eusus and Laura in Legram earlier this year, I could never have imagined this is how we would next meet. Oh, I'm sure your parents must have warned you against wandering off with such disreputable individuals on a number of occasions. But I suppose That's every child true. thinks that they alone know what is best for themselves. Duke Alborea was simply livid about what happened. But it can't hurt to learn more about the outside world, hmm? <sighs> Every word that leaves his mouth- Did you come all the way here just to tell us that? Don't be silly, child. Reen Schwarzer. I had this meeting arranged because I wanted to speak with you. We are going to be able to get our attention. Perhaps the method was a touch too garish for something so simple, but do forgive me for not formally requesting an audience. With me? <laughs> with you. Allow me to get right to the point. I wish to invite you, Ashen Chevalier, aboard our flagship. <gasps> Wait. Why? <laughs> I've heard all about your magnificent exploits across the land. And so I thought it would be nice to sit down and have a long, pleasant chat with you. About the past, the present, as well as your future. Are you suggesting... You... you want Reen to join the Noble Alliance? Should you accept my invitation? We will withdraw peacefully from Ymir. Furthermore, I give you my personal assurance that we will leave this village alone for the duration of this war. A fine proposition, is it not? Are we interested? <sighs> Very well. Allow me to accept your invitation. Don't be an idiot! This is clearly a trap! They wouldn't come all the way out here and take you into their flagship if it weren't! <laughs> I appreciate your concern. A trap or not, this might be a good chance for us, too. I think I'd regret it if I let it pass. Balamar, transport Celine back outside. Are you certain? N now hold it right there! Don't worry about me. The odds were against all of us getting back together, but we did it. And 
and I'm sure we can do it again, too. So just wait with Emma for now. I'll be back before you know it. Valimar, if you would. Very well. It seems the time has come for us to part ways once again. But remember this. You're an Alborea. There is power and dignity in that name. To whatever end you would use it. I want you to prove that the convictions you cling to are worthy of your loyalty. Not for my benefit, but for yours. Wait! Lord Rufus! Well met, Lord Schwarzer. It's a pleasure to see you again. Allow me to extend my apologies for the harm my father visited upon this town and its people. Never mind that! What do you intend to do with my son? And what is a promising young man like yourself? We're simply going to borrow young Reen for a short while. There's nothing to worry about. I'm a busy man these days, though, so for now, I bid you adieu. Reen! Reen! We all finally got back together, too. Why? Sorry, but I'll be back, I promise. Is it going in the airship? So stay safe! Rain! Rain! Like we ended chapter one, or act one. Yay! All right, this is a good place to stop. Next time we will uh, continue and see what goes on. This has been Lion of Hyrule playing Trails of Cold Steel 2, and I am signing off.